Hi guys. Uh, we're gonna load this uh, cape size vessel with a partial draft of even kill and the maximum draft is 18.23 18 forward draft will be 18.23 up draft will be 18.23 and the midship draft will be 18.23 forward draft up draft and midship draft and our trimming hold will be 9 and 1 for about 5,000 metric tons. So, for example, um, the distributors have loaded from poor number 1 up to poor 18 meaning they have advised the ship or the chief officer or the second officer or the third officer that the remaining cargoes of thousand will be loaded once we have the chief, chief officer and the draft surveyor has completed uh, reading the drafts around the ship so before loading the remaining cargo so the draft surveyor and chief officer has to go down and read the draft around the vessel. So let's say for example this is the value that they both the chief officer and the draft surveyor agreed that forward draft would be 17.77 and the aft draft will be 17.96 and the midship draft will be 17.87 so both of them will compute or how much actually will be the remaining cargo to load for number nine and number one number one so let's begin so so the oh, Chief officer on his side will put the forward graph to in his calculation, which is seven, seven forward graph is seventeen point seventy seven. Okay, seventeen point seventy seven. Seventeen point seventy seven. And after graph. is 17.96 and you will also put his speed draft port and starboard which is Seventeen point eighty seven, the mid draft. Let's say, for example, there's no list, so port will be eighteen point eighty seven, seventeen point eighty seven, seventeen point eighty seven, and starboard is seventeen point eighty seven. Okay, and his final. Departure draft or the mid draft fine it would be eighteen point two three. Eighteen point two three. Even kill or forward eighteen point two three, half eighteen point two three, and mid draft will be eighteen point two three. So we put here eighteen point two three. Eighteen point two three has a value, a TPC value of one three eight point seven one. And this one eight one three eight point seven one. And your sink gauge will be point thirty six centimeters. To get this value to be loaded, 
exchange gauge multiplied by the TPC times 100, you will get this value of cargo to load or recommended cargo to load for trimming. So the value for recommended cargo to load for trimming is 4,993.614 or 4,994. So that is the recommended cargo to load. So we put here 4,994 4, Okay Once What will be the result of the sinkage and the mid draft when we load 4,994 So the results after loading the mid draft will be 18.23, which is the same of the final draft, mid draft, and your sinkage is 0.36, also the same of your sinkage. So, this is the exact figure you will load to get the exact value of mid draft of 18.23. And here, take note of this one your mid draft is 18.23 which is this one after you have loaded 4994 and min drop would be 18.23 which we will see later so he has already he has already a deflection of zero or 0 0.0048 sub so we will now distribute 4994 to hold one and nine and we will see the results of the draft. So here we have 4,994. We put here, trimming hold is number one and number nine. So, for drop, forward drop was 70.77, up drop was 90.96. This is your main drop, 17.8665, which is almost 17.87. So, we will put now the trim. The trim is even here, which is zero. So how much now are going to load in hold number one? So hold number one will be 2,477. And number nine will be 2,516.71. So 2,477 for number one. 2,477 for number one. And for number 9 will be 2517. So, what will be our graph? So, here 1777. Half drop is 17.96. Dream of 0.19. Mean drop of 17.6. So, we load. Number one of 2,477 LCG of negative 177.91 LCG moment of this value. And number nine, 2,517 LCG in this LCG moment. And finally, we will get the since a, a change of trim will forward and change of dream out so computing these values we have a final draft of 18.225 forward and half will be 18 18.225 half which is almost 18.23 so it's an even kill no trim and your mean 
is also 18.2253, which is almost 18.223. So it's an even kill. And your deflection is 0 or 0 0.0048. Take note of this mean, 18.2253. This is where you will get the mean of 18.2253, which is zero deflections with regards to mid and the mean or a sag of 0 0.0048 centimeters which is zero so wala zero talaga yung deflection niya it's ito talaga yung ano niya ito talaga yung ito talaga yung ano niya yung mean departure drop so halimbawa Let's say, for example, the surveyor says, no, I won't accept 4,994. According to my computation, you should load So what happens if we load 4,100? So what will be the results of five, we load if we load 5,100? Five, so you will get a mid draft of 183777 and a sinkage of 0.3677. So there's an increase of 0 0.0027. 0, 0 to 7 in sinkage. So what will be the draft, proper draft, and the uh, load to be load, or cargo to be load in hold number 1 and 9? So, cargo to be loaded number 1 would be 2524. 2,524 So, hold number 1 will be 2,524 and hold number 9 will be 2,576 So what will be our departure graph for the results? So we got here, hold 1, 2,524, and 9, 2,576. So what will be our departure graph? So he cheers. The final graph forward is 18.233. Up is 18.233. So it's still okay. Pasok pa siya sa departure drop natin. Excess lang siya ng 0 0.003 which is negligible. And the deflection of 0. So, the volume, main value is 18.2329 18.2329 and here we are 18.2329 and your mid draft mid draft will be 18.2377 which is this one if you put if you loaded 5100 your mid drop will be 18.2 so this is excess but paano sa maging excess let's say let's put 5200 ayun na excess na siya 1824 so sobra na yung kargamento so it will be a, you will be overloaded if you put 5200 let's say we put 5000 5150 50. still overload See, look at the mid 
drop but your deflection still would be zero so let's say five one twenty five Let's say fifty to five. Fifty to five. Let's say you load five thousand twenty five. Now if you load five thousand twenty five, your mid drop would be eighteen point two three, which is very very good. And your sink gauge would be point three six point point zero three six two three which is a little over or point zero zero two three which is okay and look here your mid drop is two eighteen point two three two three and mid drop is eighteen point two three here and your main drop is eighteen foot so how much shall we load in hole number one and nine? So, 50, 2, 5. so hole number one, fifty two five two four nine one. You will load in number one and number nine two four three four. So two two four nine one in number one. So in number nine will be two five three four and number one will be two four nine one. And what will be the drop? So it's almost eighteen twenty three. Forward drop will be eighteen point two two seven and up drop will be eighteen point two seven. So you will still have a zero de deflection here in hold number one you hold you load 2491 and 9 2534 and the value of your graph we still 18.227 forward and R will be 18.227 F with a trim of zero and main drop will be 18.2275 to the deflection zero so take note of this main graph 18.2275 and here you are 18.18.225 your main drop and your mid drop after loading 5000 225 will be 18.2323 and your mid trip here is 18.23 so just take note of this mid draft if this will this is where you know you will know you will be overload or less cargo so this is very important so the recommended draft will not always be the same but you can go over more a little, a little bit but not so much so what is the excess cargo here from the uh, recommended cargo to load so that will be 29 metric tons more from the recommended cargo so it's still okay as long as you get target of this 18.23 uh, you want really the exact value of 18.23 mid drop so you load 4,994 para exacto pero kung so I hope you will uh, uh, like this guys and uh, take note of what is uh, what's the role of this uh, mid draft and uh, loading of uh, excess cargo so guy thanks and thank you